Everything is just super easy and you can do it at your own pace. There's no rush and there's no side effects. Breathing that in, it just changes your whole uh, field and makes you feel really good. It just gives me a little lift and a little bit of relief that nothing else could. I've noticed a lot of direct changes in my life working with essential oils. Just being more centered and calm and self-assured and confident that I'm doing the right thing and in the right direction. These oils are ancient and they're modern at the same time. Do you find yourself limited by emotional patterns or find yourself in emotional ruts? Do certain situations trigger your anger? Are you frustrated, affected by rejection, disappointment? I'm Dr. Carolyn Mine, and I wrote Releasing Emotional Patterns with Essential Oils as a way of addressing a lot of these emotional patterns. In Egypt, they used essential oils as a way of clearing emotional patterns. What the oils do is they activate the sense of smell. The sense of smell accesses the limbic system of the brain, which is the seat of emotions. This was a way of releasing the emotional patterns on a very deep cellular level, so we can transmute the emotion once and for all. Releasing Emotional Patterns with Essential Oils is a self-help book. It's used as a reference guide. First thing you want to do is identify the emotion. What are you feeling? It will also give you a reference to the acupuncture alarm point and where it's found. You go to this section on the charts and this way you can find the location of the point and go through the process which is right behind the emotions and that is connecting with the emotions, both the positive and the negative, saying the affirmation, applying the oil to the acupuncture alarm points. If you notice a problem with a certain area of your body, whether it's gallbladder, liver, spleen, kidneys, ligaments, go to the charts and you'll find the location of the point on the chart. From there, you can look at the body reference point and it will show you what emotion is stored and also the oil that's appropriate. There is a section on body type and this has to do with the emotions that are challenges for each particular body type. Each particular body type has their challenges. When you meet those challenges, those challenges are your greatest strengths.